So I wanted to make this video real quick before I went to bed, right? I'm tired of the motherfucker. I'm finna get in my bed. I've been up since 6 a.m. and I've been filming content all motherfucking day. So I'm finna lay down and go to fuck to sleep. But I wanted to make this video before I went to sleep because I feel like a lot of you motherfuckers need to hear it. So if you a guy right now, right, and you into the dating shit, you've been texting girls, trying to get you a girlfriend, dating, chopping it up, fucking hoes, etc., etc., right? One thing that you gotta learn when it comes to to females is you got to learn to not give a fuck, okay? And what do I mean by not giving a fuck, right? It's a lot of simp-ass niggas out here that be pitting females on pedestals, validating these bitches all goddamn day, calling them, FaceTiming them all goddamn day, just being a thirsty-ass, bitch-ass, simp, soft-ass nigga, right? And a lot of these niggas be wondering why females be leaving them, cheating on them, and go sucking some other dick. The reason is because you give a fuck too goddamn much. And as a dude, when you when it come to dating, you can't really be giving a fuck too goddamn much. This is one of the things I had to learn. My pussy rate ain't really start going up until I stop giving a fuck. I don't know why it's like that in life, but it's like when you stop giving a fuck about shit, everything you want and just start to come like if you're a person that's so worried about goddamn money i guarantee you the moment you stop giving a fuck about money you're gonna start having opportunities come your way you're gonna start having motherfuckers call you putting you in money positions motherfucking the job finally want to hire you nigga when you was worried all that goddamn time ain't nobody was calling your black ass back to work for him but now that you stopped worrying about the shit and you just like fuck it and all this shit starting to happen that's how it is with females it's like it's like the moment you stop giving a fuck about how a bitch feel, how she feel about you, just, just, you just don't give a fuck about a bitch. But I'm telling you, all the bitches gonna come. I don't know why. And it's like a woman like you more when you don't give a fuck. One of the things I learned is like, you gotta always put your purpose in the forefront of everything you do, okay? You gotta always put your purpose in front of these bitches. If you one of those, because you gotta think, most females are used to guys that simps. They used to guys that's val validating them all the time. They used to guys that's stopping what they doing for the female. They used to guys that's always answering, always available, always hitting them up first. Like that's what they used to. They female, especially bad bitches. Bad bitches get that all day, every day. So when they finally get a guy that's not treating them that way, like them simps was treating them, they more, they intrigued. They like that shit. They, 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 they find it attractive. Because they used to guys that's always up their ass. So you being that guy that don't give a fuck, she 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 probably want to fuck you even more now because it's something in you that 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 ain't in the mother niggas. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you got her hook. If you one of those guys that went on a date with her type shit, and she's starting to like you, she like your vibe, she like how you is in person and shit like that. And and then after after that, um, you start acting like you don't give a fuck, but she gonna wonder shit. And that's one of the things with females. You got to keep their ass wandering. You got to let a bitch know that she can be replaced. And if you show a bitch that she can be replaced, then I guarantee you she probably going to act fucking right. Now, if you a sweet, soft ass nigga that's always sending to good morning to, hey, beautiful, and good morning, beautiful, and uh, I hope you have a good day, babe. Like all that goofy ass shit. Like, listen, I ain't saying this is... I'm not saying it's not okay to text a girl. I'm not I'm not saying it's, it's, it's not okay to text a good morning text here and there. But you just can't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to have that mindset of, hey, if this bitch leaves, she leave. I don't give a fuck. You got to have that mindset of, hey, if she curves, she curve. If, 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 if she cheats, she cheat. Like, you just can't care when it comes to females, bro. Because you just can't care. That's just how the game's supposed to be motherfucking played. They like niggas that just don't care. I don't know why it's like that. You can't ask me. I don't fucking know. I think it's a psychological thing. I think a lot of these bitches is discombobulated and fucking retarded sometimes. Um, and some of them is just all fucked up in the brain. Like, women like things that's bad. I don't know. They don't like sweet guys. Like, all that movie shit, that shit is not real. That, that shit not realistic. Like, movies and, and buying a bitch flowers and my like, bitches just be talking shit when they say i learned like that hot park of me shit that's real deal shit because bitches everything that bitches say they like it's the opposite so if a bitch say she like a nice guy what she really mean is she like a mean nigga if a bitch say she like a clingy nigga what she really mean is she like a nigga that put his work first and ain't that fucking clingy she like a nigga that that's hustling when a bitch say she don't like toxic niggas she really means she like toxic niggas why you think, like, I always thought this too. Like, when I was growing up, I always thought, like, man, I'm a nice dude. 
You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm cool as fuck. I'm a nice dude, respectful. I'm a gentleman. Like, how is these corny, busted ass niggas getting more pussy than me? And I'm nicer than them niggas. Like, I was, I was playing everything by the book, being a kind, genuine hearted nigga, right? And it was niggas that was ugly as hell in their fucking hoes. You feel what I'm saying? It was fucking hoes. But one of the things that they had over me is they had, they just wasn't giving a fuck. They was they self and they ain't give a fuck. Okay? That's why bitches like the bad niggas. That's why they like street guys and shit like that. Because street niggas don't give a fuck. That's why these bitches like street niggas. That's why these bitches like fucking toxic niggas and all that crazy shit. Because they like niggas that don't give a fuck about them for real. <laughs> like, I don't know why it's like that, bro. You can, man, you ain't even got to ask a female this shit. Because most females ain't even going to admit it. But based on their actions, you could just, you it just show it right there. Like, based on their actions and the niggas that they date, it just go to show you that these females like niggas that don't give a fuck. I don't know why. So, you gotta be one of those niggas that don't give a fuck. Like, and ever since I stopped giving a fuck, I've been getting more pussy. Uh, I've been, more females been fucking with a nigga. I feel like more females get more attached to you when you don't give a fuck. They be on your dick. When they see you don't give a fuck, they be on your dick. They wanna know what you're doing, where you at. Why you act in a certain type of way. You got to keep a motherfucker wandering. That's how you keep a bitch. You keep a bitch by keeping her ass wandering. You don't want her, you don't want her to know your whole play style, nigga. This shit like Madden. You can't, you can't let a bitch like know your whole play style. Because then she, then now she knows she got you. If you let a bitch know your whole shit, she got you. She ain't going to act right. But if you show a bitch she can be replaced, I guarantee you she going to act right. Like, baby, I don't need your ass. I can sit up and watch The Walking Dead all motherfucking day and forget your punk ass. You know what I'm saying? As soon as I light this motherfucking blunt, it's going to be over with. Light this blunt and watch The Walking Dead, your ass going to be somewhere in the past, baby. I ain't even going to be thinking about your motherfucking ass. That's the mindset you got to have. You can't be always up a bitch ass. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just can't. You can't. Because females don't like all that extra shit. They, they, they can't stand a nigga that's always available and just too much. So you got to be that nigga that I don't give a fuck, okay? Like, that's just how it is. I don't know why it's like that, though. I don't know. We live in a weird generation and a weird time, but just look at all the girls that live in your city and look at the guys that they dating. They ain't dating no nice guys, I guarantee you. They dating street niggas. They dating shooters. They dating niggas that's going in and out the pen. They dating niggas that's toxic, beating their ass. Like, I ain't never understood that. Like, how can... How can you, like, date a nigga that beat your ass? It's like, bro, like, if the nigga beat your ass, right, you can't be on the internet be like, my baby daddy didn't beat my ass, woo, woo, woo. You can't even, you can't, like, how you expose the nigga for knocking you the fuck out and then you still back with him? It's like, cuz, like, females is, they, they, the way they think is just weird. Like, nobody will never understand it, but I ain't saying beat on the bitch. Don't beat on the bitch. Listen, your ass gonna go to jail. Don't do that. But all I'm saying is just don't give a fuck. Like, just don't care. If you're a nigga that used to care and be a simp, don't care. Like, if she, if she hits you back, she she hits you back. If she don't, fuck them. If she let you fuck, so be it. If she don't, fuck it. Just don't give a fuck. <laughs> and I, hey, better shit gonna happen to you. But I'm about to get in my bed, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this shit. I'm gone.